Binders by Rachel Carnes, directed by Daniel G. Husson. What does this do? Stop. What? Don't. Why? That's... Sorry. What... It's okay. You're new. I lack guidelines. Tell him, not me. I'm brimming over with enthusiasm. We might miss that thing later on. No regrets. It did the thing. Was the thing important? It wasn't unimportant. I haven't been here long. Long enough, though. Stand still. Sit there. I'm angry. Not my problem. I'm angry, too. I just want someone to hear that. We're here now. Have you ever measured your own head? I really measured it? You're not helping. Well, I'm here, and I want to be useful. Useful is cup holders. Look at these beauties. Best ever. When we look back, do you think we'll feel fondness? That depends. On what? On where we are, what we each contribute. Well, I don't have any contributions to make, except this. What's that? What do you think it is? It's an in-between. A liminal space. A place between here and now and the distance. You seem thick, like your ligaments need oiling. Did you stretch today? I forgot. We're at the place of no return. Well, that sounds ominous. Rebranding, please? The yellow light at the intersection, where you just have to go for it. We don't know where it is yet. Does that bother you? They asked us these questions before we got here. All those turns you did back home? You went upside down a bunch. It's just... Gird your loins, Fred! This is the plan. It's just... There's this feeling... Like I don't know enough stories. Where do you keep this feeling? Here. That's a bad spot. I thought it would go away. But I keep feeling it. They said there would be pangs. Like at summer camp, it fades. You should go canoeing. Let's try to be constructive. What if when I get there, I don't know enough? We brought the book. It has everything. Like how the universe was born, how to make a sweater. Here. How will I ever tell the next generation what a giraffe was for? We have them aboard, right here in this test tube. They can speak for themselves. But where will we put them when we get there? It's all in the binder. Giraffes are late stage. Rhinos, chinchillas, we, we've got millet and corn and soybeans. We'll, we'll plant. We're going... Too fast to slow down now. I can still see Earth. Maybe we could put this thing in reverse. Okay. You've had enough window time. Go clean hoses, Fred. I'm next on the window schedule. No, I am. You don't get the window. You got to call home, so you lost your window privilege. Calling home doesn't bump me off the window schedule. It's getting... smaller. It's your spleen that's making you feel sad, Fred. You should have had it removed before the trip. I thought this would be easier. What if I don't have enough wisdom to impart? No one does. Everyone is stupid. The only people who aren't stupid are the ones who are just about to die. What if I fail? We're sailors, Fred. You, me, and Barney. Our only job is to navigate. All we have to do is follow the schedule. Food, clothing, shelter. That's not the right order. We have everything. Seeds, sperm, soil samples. We've got YouTube videos of hamsters eating burritos. Will there be rain on Mars? We've got music. They made us a mixtape. It's an earbud you keep in your anus, but they still call it a mixtape. All of humanity in 20 songs. Seemed like a good round number. Can I listen to it now? It might help. I've got mine on mute. I've got mine on vibrate. (laughs) I don't like these walls. Does this look straight to you? Clean lines. Good bones. Do you think I can get these rivets off? Try your thumbnails. Or your teeth. Barney, where's the folder with all the uh, uh, contingencies? My jaw is clicking. Should it be clicking? Can you hear that? The contingencies are in the red binder, Betty. It it just seems like this floor is sticking to me. The red binder is all recipes. Uh, Oh, here's one for bundt cake. What's a bundt cake? It's a cake with a hole in the middle. It's our legacy. My heart is racing. Feel that? I'm dizzy. I'm all sweaty. Right? Try the yellow binder. Get the yellow one. Flip to the back. Pass the amputation part. That's a really remote possibility. But it's good to be ready with a tourniquet just in case. 
if it comes to that, let's all agree that we'll hold each other's hands. Like, I'll saw you lay there, Fred, biting the leather strap, and, and Betty will let you just give her a good, firm grip. They gave us a place in the back of each binder for notes. I'll write down that plan. The trick is to see the storm coming and just ignore it. It might pass right by. I can't feel my elbows anymore. Oh, or my knees. Do they feel clammy to you? <laughs> What's in this blue binder? I've never seen this blue binder before. Did you get training in the blue binder, Fred? They thought of everything, right? But what about when you're losing control on the ice and you start to spin? You have to turn into it. That's not natural. That's not intuitive at all. I learned that when I learned to drive. And my whole life, I've worried that if I was on the ice and I was spinning out of control, I'd forget and spin away and make it worse. I found the right section in the yellow binder. My eyeballs are sinking. Hurry up. What does it say to do? It says to give Fred the green pill. What's the green pill? Uh, Fred, do you want the green pill? It's a lot of pressure. You're losing control. Here you go. This will help you just, you know... Just sweep all this up. We're the ones. Us. Doesn't that make you feel proud? I don't know how to trap a raccoon. I can't fix a broken toaster. We're made of tough stuff. Here's your nozzle. That's my nozzle. I thought you were the pink one. I'm the purple nozzle. I've been using the purple nozzle this whole time. My bad. Have you been using both of my nozzles? You mean all three nozzles? We each get three. We do? What color am I? Oh my god. You, you guys, I'm putting all the nozzles in the autoclave now. And here's your pill, Fred. Under your tongue. That's the way it melts on contact. It's cherry flavor. Let's settle you down for your nap. Mm, my hair is singing to me. You need rest, sailor. When we get there, we can grow alfalfa. And we can grow a blue whale. Oh, where are we gonna put the blue whale? Good night, Fred. I know we can't go outside, but it would be easier for me if you could do sad instead of this. There's a gap here. Feel that? A small chasm. You could lose something. Rings. Baby teeth. Stand back. I'll get the phone. I'm gonna take a look. What do you see? It's all disjointed. Is that bad? It's not not bad. Is the hole getting bigger? The foam should hold it. Here. Big foam. Look around. This is unstable. Well, there's potential, though. When we met, you had boundless optimism. I, I just don't have the time. I wish I could feel safe. And we don't even have a sofa. Not one throw pillow up here. Just don't think about it. Rainbows. What rainbows? All I see is void. Close your eyes and... There won't be rainbows on Mars. I'll never see a rainbow again. Try fluffy guinea pigs. They're cloven little hooves. They're not cloven. Don't know anything! I have a memory of guinea pigs running in slow motion. And we're gonna die. I'm worried about you. How are you doing? Not great! Did you think about the ice caps? It's... It was hard not to. But they packed us plenty of dental floss. Thought there would be more than this. I don't have the energy to knock these together. How long has it been since you slept? Okay, the foam is hardening. See, there was a problem, but thanks to this, it's covered up now. Let, let's have lunch, maybe meatloaf. But it's not a loaf if it comes in a bag. I mean, it's not even meat. I like it. It's something to rely on. It's, it's like mom's. Mom. Do you want to turn at the wheel? What wheel? The the, the buttons, the, the, the knobs, the, the, the fiddle-faddles. The, this takes you in a curvy pathway. Where should we go? We already know where we're going. It's, it's, a, it's a penny drop, a, a smackdown, a loose screw. Where is that? A place 
that's great for growing alfalfa. <gasps> what do we do with the alfalfa? Sandwiches. Salads. I, I think it's for the cows. Have you ever met a cow? No. Have you? It's a minimally invasive procedure. What? Nothing. Have you ever thought about how pants have changed? Not once. Good morning? Pants have changed a lot. Thirsty? Pants evolve. Someday you'll be older, and you'll see these things. I'm itchy. Drink this, Fred. It will balance you. Well, not, not so fast. Oh, how long was I out? Few people notice the subtle changes to pants over the years. Now it says to roll your wrists and ankles. But I've always been observant. Make a starfish shape. A point and flex. Focus your eyes back and forth, up and down, around in a circle. Stick out your tongue. Pull your ears. Is this supposed to help? Fred, were you a flat front or a pleated khakis man? You never asked me that question, Barney. Boxers or briefs? Wait, don't answer. We had lots of time for you to ask me. Let me guess. Boxers. I'm tingling. I might fly away. Do you want to hold my flashlight? Sure. I like the red button. I find it soothing. It's my legs feel like bean bags. Is that good? I told you we brought him up too fast. Fred? You're just a little bit depressurized. Dissolving gases are coming out of your blood and making bubbles in your body. Ugh, dull ache in my joints. Ugh, a stabbing sensation. Try yodeling. Slide the red button on the flashlight and breathe in and out. There. Isn't that nice? <sighs> Slide the... I'm sliding. Wall speaks when they have mess. This is your fault, Betty. Dirty slime amidst antiquated hoopla. Where is the binder on disorganization? We had the tabulated data. You ignored it. Are there tiny insects crawling all over me? Fred is swelling up. Junction one, distant fragile. I... But we follow the procedure on the printed card. It's laminated. That's the one for making nachos. And on the back, there is a decompression schedule. See? It says to preheat the oven to 350 degrees and place the tortilla chips on a baking sheet. Obey, space cat. I thought I was doing it right. Are you my mother? They said that sometimes it won't be possible to discriminate between right and wrong options. Fred, are you experiencing unexplained fatigue, headache, generalized malaise? I'm fine if I don't breathe. Don't worry, buddy. I got you. What is that? It's our ultra-deep water, dynamically positioned, semi-submersible drilling rig. I don't think you're supposed to take it out of its packaging. He's having a full anaconda blowout. Dog bike. Sleep jump! It says in the binder that these symptoms could lead to... collapse? You remembered to close the blowout preventer valves before bringing him up, right? Um... Don't blame yourself. We only had a day to train on the decompression trapeze. It says that at this rate and duration, we can- I, I know, let's permanently seal Fred with cement. Deodorant speaks. Try sliding the red button on the flashlight differently, Fred. More thumb. And if that doesn't work, we'll plug this insertion tube into his pipe. Time out. I want to agree to rule out conventional explosives. Obviously. Whether the blast succeed or fail, we will have denied ourselves all other options. Hey, look. Fred? I'll check his rhythmic throbbing. Is he? No, no, no. He's, he's just in a static position. It's childlike, isn't it? Looks so peaceful. Sucking his thumb. It's a reflex. It helps him feel secure. Fred, can you hear me? Squeeze my hand if- I had a dream. We were in a solar storm. Jesus, you scared me. It's not a solar storm, Fred. They call it a solar event. 
They seem very real. Like there's syrup happening. Will there be pancakes? We can have pancakes when we get there. But the storm... People say I'm a discoverer. Don't make us look at the newspaper clipping from your hometown again. In my dream, the heat shields only held for a few hours. Days at the most. Days, Fred. That's a comfort. It's nice to know that the heat shields might work. Fred dreamed it. You must be hungry after all that sleep. Liquid chicken marsala? I dibs the last one. You didn't put your name on it. You're not giving Fred the last liquid chicken marsala. It's mine. But if the heat shields fail, how will we land on Mars, even if we get there? That was the last entree. We still have the freezer full of heavy appetizers. It's not a meal. I can't live on crudité. I see things. In-flight consequences, long-term effects. A regular Magellan. Who's that? He got his name from the penguins. What if the dream I had was a... What's it called? When you see something? A movie! I'm picking the movie this week. We just have one movie up here, and the dog... Well, you know. No spoilers. The dog dies. In a solar storm... Solar um, event. If... And when we get to Mars' atmosphere, I'm afraid the ship will... The heat shields will protect us. Sure. Right. No problem. Fred might be on to something. We don't really have a firm handle on galactic cosmic rays. They and did so the we... math. And we all used to like pleated khakis, but now we like flat fronts. And pockets. People love pockets. We'll never make it to Mars. Energetic particles come from all over the galaxy towards the solar system and Earth. You can't shield against them. They're so powerful, they'll rip right through all metals, all plastic, all water, and all cellular material. I've read all the manuals. We are made of cellular material. It's all gonna go. Poof. I like to keep a rubber band in my pocket at all times. Do you want one? We set sail on this new sea because there is new knowledge to be gained. Pull the lever, then. I can't just pull the lever. Then I will. Wait, stop. I know enough to know not to just pull the lever. Do it. I dare you. Last time I pulled a lever... What's the worst that could happen? No strife, no prejudice, no conflict here. That's... They tried to design this spacecraft out of materials that will shield the crew from radiation, but that also do not produce more hazardous particles as a function of being in it and- But we're in it. Cheers to a healthy crew and a long productive life. We'll build a new city on the ruins of the old. Pull the lever. Let's test it first. If our spaceship succeeds- I I If? When? When we get there, we will have literally reached the stars before midnight. All I want to do is take my socks off again. All this equipment, we can't have socks. This country was conquered by those that move forward. High costs, hardships. These hard and difficult beginnings. Discontented murmurings. Maybe if we made some snowshoes. Should this light be turning on and off? Flows of energy. Rapid communication. Coordinated movement. Shape shifting in the sky. This readout's bleeping at me. Hey, hey, this doesn't look good. One swirling liquid mass. Safety in numbers. We move as an intelligent cloud. I'm getting a report. Will you two shut up? We're at the corner, but we can't see around it. Look in the binder. Which one? That's why they used to have those mirrors. The one set on an angle. The readout is like light snow before the avalanche. Look. It's just velocity. Orientation. Put it in the drawer. Ignore it. You didn't even read the binder. It's your job to read it. It was the thing's job to read it, and you threw it out into space. Does it feel chilly to you? Why didn't they give us lap blankets? I, how hard would it have been to have lap blankets? Should I turn up the thermostat? Before this happens, we have to send a message. This isn't happening. It says in the binder, in a solar event, assume the brace position. Brace position! Concentrate. What should we say? Who are we talking to? I don't know. The, the future? The past? Posterity. Where's that? My finger's right here on the button. Right where it should be. Do you want to count it down? That's generous of you. You did get to count it down last time. I think it's my turn. You're good at it. It's one of your strengths. 
Thank you. I mean, some people hesitate, act all full of themselves. Not me. Not you. You're the right combination. Ah, oh, the winning combo. I thought I was going to get to do the countdown. Commanding yet vulnerable. I'm well trained. It just kicks in. It's inspiring. It really is. Is it? Now. Three. Two. Wait. What? Are you counting down? I thought you were. You said you were going to press I'm lever. not going I... to do it until you say so. You want me to count down your counting down. It's like training wheels. Finger on the button. Three, two, one. Emily Dickinson never did any chores. Fred. Emily Dickinson never did chores. All her sisters did, but her dad didn't make her do any. Who's Emily Dickinson? Poet, blah, 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 hope is a thing with the- Chores are important. It's the only way to build responsibility. Paper roots, litter box. Chores grow hair on your chest. Emily Dickinson's dad recognized she needed more time, that she was special. Chores don't keep you from writing poetry. Not being able to write poetry keeps you from writing poetry. Three, two, wait! What? Do you see that? What is that? It looks like, I don't like it. That's the system. Kapow! Looks like the whole world is on fire. Are we still here? The wing over the horizon. Did they do the math for this? Barney, fasten your seatbelt while seated. Let's count it down. Three, two. Is it okay when I do this? Please stop. I don't want you to do that. Have you stopped dreaming? When? Hey, At night. Do you dream anymore? I see lists in my head. Toothpicks, couch cushions. I I wander. I wish I could hear the ocean. Cup your hands to your ear. Do it. I don't hear anything. That's on you. I feel lost. I used to. Not anymore. What's your secret? I'm not telling. There was this place I used to go to. It felt so green, so so quiet. I, I, I miss it. We're here now. What is this place? I'm used to it. I feel better now that I got everything to line up. All the angles are right. You see? I don't see that at all. Right angles are something you can feel. Isn't that better? I do feel better. That's nice. Before, you felt seasick, right? My joints were all achy. But now I feel not so... What's that? It's a new survey. They want us to rate our experience. I do have some pain points. They're going to transform our feedback into continuous improvements. Who is they? They? You're always dissatisfied. Do you want to jump with me? Where? That way. What's over there? I don't know. sitting in the airport and I'm I'm listening for the boarding announcement and I just tune out, you know? I hadn't slept well the night before. And no one sleeps well the night before. Slept. You get that panic. Got. The, what if I don't wake up on time? What if my car doesn't show? What if he can't find me? Why do you assume he's a he? And I'm sitting and I'm tuning out and the guy whose job it is to make the announcements. The drivers if- are always men. They were. This gate attendant's got this deep voice. Sounds like gravel. He he gets on the microphone and he's like, 
Ladies and Barbara Fitnanooga Boogie. So, I keep spacing out. I used to love airports. All those muffins. I look up, and, and the gate's nearly empty. I leave my stuff, I run over, I say, are, are you boarding the flight to... He looks at me and says, we board it. I'm an idiot. Who misses a flight by just sitting there? What were you doing, Fred? I, I don't know. But the door is still open. The man at the gate, he's unintelligible, but nice. Saints and battle axes. He says, last name. There's hope in that. The door's open, and he asks my last name. He, he clicks the buttons on his magic computer, and voila, go get your stuff. He's, he's going to leave the door open for me. The guy's there to close it, but... What guy? Uh, neon vest, ear things, they protect. He had big boots on. Looked cold. Those guys get glowing orange wands. Or, or, or they did. I get my stuff, all of it. I leave my plastic yogurt parfait container right on the floor. And, and I walk down the jetway. Run, really. The ear thing guy says, I haven't had lunch. No lunch. He says, I won't get a lunch till 8 o'clock. And I'm filled with shame. Well, it's not your fault he didn't get a break. What kind of loser can't even get on a plane? I'm the last one on. And I roll in, pretending I've been in a hurry, like I, I just made my connection. But the guy in the seat next to mine recognizes me from the terminal. The guy who'd been sitting next to me, eating his egg sandwich and crinkling his yellow egg sandwich paper and pushing his straw in and out of his soda for no apparent reason, says, Hey, we have a moment. He knows. He knows I was just sitting there. But you got on the plane. It all worked out. No, it didn't. I, I put my stuff in the overhead compartment and sit down and I settle in and the flight attendant comes up and says, I'm sorry, your seat doesn't go back. Technology. I don't care. It was a short flight. An hour, maybe, right over the snowy mountains. But, you know. Your seat wouldn't go back. And then my neighbor, Egg Sandwich, he says... We sat here on the tarmac for an hour while they tried to fix your seat. Huh. Don't you get it? He was trying to tell you to fasten your seatbelt. He was casually mentioning that you could use your cushion for a flotation device. That seat was my seat. And this is my seat. My seat spins. What, what's your point? My seat was broken. A and that delayed the plane. And that meant I got on, even though I just... Things used to happen, Fred. Please don't get all spongy. Walking onto that plane with the broken seat made me realize... You're coming apart again, aren't you? Did you take your vitamins today? I like to slather myself with vitamin lotion. We know. I don't need vitamins. I'm having an epiphany. We're happy for you, Fred. But someone has to press the button. God is an unintelligible but benevolent God gate agent. That's not important. We've got soil, sperm, seaweed. We'll disperse. Like blowing a dandelion. Whoosh. Whoosh. I don't want to do this anymore. Fred, you give me those... Put down the binders. I'm sending them into the stratosphere. Step away from the sucking hole. We don't need these. We need them for everything. This one's a list of mammals and their extinct relatives. Goodbye. But giant sloths, I... This binder's full of craft ideas for the holidays. The future needs us to explain turkey hands. Don't do it. Fred, look, over here. I'll put my hand on the moisture-sensitive thinking wall and draw around my fingers. And when I take my hand away, see? Doesn't it look like a turkey? It looks like God telling me to do this. Adios. Give him another green pill. We're out of green pills. Check the junk drawer. We have some pencil erasers and a few packs of gum. That's it. How long did they think this would take? They had big numbers, guys, going on this. We're working big, round numbers. I go right down the jetway. Fred, stop sending the binders into space. I should have missed that plane. Only me, God, and the Earthing guy knew my secret. 
They told us we need those. Do you think that planets can talk to each other? Betty, help me grab him. Soothing tones, Barney. In, out, relax. Fred, you try it with me. My breath has butterflies in it. Fred, let's come over here and have a seat. I got on that plane and I get to the airport and she's waiting and I'm tired, but I offer to drive anyway. It's late, dark, foggy night, and I don't see the truck and, and I come to. We're not going to crash. Even if we do, we won't know it. I shouldn't be here. I should have missed that flight. If I missed that flight, then she would still be here. It's okay. Let it out. (sighs) But keep it all in. Barney, what is the secondary protocol? (sighs) The secondary protocol is in the Q through S binder that Fred just sucked into space. But we still have G through J. Gerbils, jump roping, good stuff, Fred. Maybe try this. Every single thing. They give you free soup. Is this a drill? I didn't see it on the calendar. If we're forced to make an emergency exit, don't bring lit cigarettes, briefcases, or high heels. Exit at the front and the rear. But where are we supposed to exit to? Look for the little red light. Before exiting, check to see that it's safe. Fire! Should I get my nozzle? Is this real or not? Open the door. The slide will automatically inflate. Hang on to it. Sit down. Tight against each other. You can't sit down. You can't scooch. There is no scooching. This is pretend. Crouching feels natural. Scooching seems right. We just have to jump. Okay. Okay, hot shots. I'll deploy the life raft. I can't. Did you take your credible fear interview? Tie the strap to the door handle. You don't want to float away. Barney, they measured your tolerance for severe pain and suffering. I once waited almost three hours for brunch. Pull on the raft. Yank it. Am I blowing up this life vest correctly? It isn't expanding. Why isn't it expanding? Let me do those bubbles, Betty. Come here. I can't get the little light to come on. Even if your light is on, who's going to find you? Lean on me and close your eyes. It's like sleeping. I don't like the sound. I can't do this. I lack the strength, the mobility, and both my arms and both my legs. Hold my lighter. You can't have that prohibited item in here. Then I'm taking your portable radio. No one lays a finger on my remote control car. Fred! This is only a drill. Grasp and push. Pull and turn. What? Remove the obstructions. Uh, I can't manipulate the mechanisms. But you have to. Fred lacks ability. I can't balance anymore. Just keep steaming. Our speed is tremendous right now. My my contact lens is... My hearing aids... The faster we're going, the better. This will put the wind on the stern a little more. I don't remember the hand signals. I've been through worse than this. We're not meant to Don't have to... freeze up. I'm not leaving you. I'm a goner. In the beginning, I was completely unable to do it also. So. We'll be about 60 miles south of the eye. It should be fine. We are going to be fine. Are you still there? We are going to be fine. The air is better. The beeping stopped. See? Final assembly? Hey, I managed to survive another hour. You've come to a place where... Hold my hand. Wait with me. Just not to part for a second or two longer.
burning up. Hold him down, tighter. Bite this. Almost over. There. See? It's easier when they pass out. I, I can't. One, two, three. I know that. Everyone has to start somewhere. You do it. Just feel the weight of the saw in your hand. Which one? Let the tool do the work. Not enough practice. Don't think too hard. The rent, the bleeding. You'll get used to that. I, I don't think I ever... Cut here. All right. Around the kneecap. Um... Cut it quick. Cut it quick in a circular motion. That's the way. No explanations. Now, pull the muscle up and over. Pain. Make the sutures firm. He's... Give the knots a good tug. Now the bandage. No. This one's clean enough. We leave the wound open. The binder says we bandage the site. Let the air do the work. But the binder says... Lord willing, it will heal on its own. I got blood on my manual. Shellback. This was brand new. Son of Neptune! You cross the equator. I've never been anywhere. Ducked in the ocean. I'm right here. King Neptune sailing around the Horn of Africa. Bloody hands wiped on my starch white apron. The crew draws up a list of everyone on board, including dogs and cats and... Dogs and cats? And they give it to the captain, who... Are you quite all right? The captain interrogates them as to whether they've crossed the equator. And me? You have to choose. Choose? Choose to give up, or get ducked three times into the ocean. We're in a landlocked state. Some come out of the water grinning and exulting in their hardiness. When did you last sleep? And some... Are almost suffocated. I may be inexperienced in this. Hands up! Shorten sails! Wipe my bow saw. You want the tissue to be light pink and moist. They gave me a saw with a curved handle. Neptune is received with watery honors. They gave me three different knives. In the darkness and heat of the lower deck, one at a time, we're blindfolded and led up. What do I do with these? Listen closely. You are placed on a plank easily tilted up into a large bath of water. They lather your face and mouth with pitch and paint and scrape some of it off with a piece of roughened iron hoop. A signal being given, you are tilted head over heels into the water. I am standing on the good earth. Dirty mixtures put in your mouth and rubbed on your faces. The whole ship a shower bath. Water flying in every direction. This brutal baptism. Not one person, even the captain, gets clear of being wet through. Started today as a polywog. And look at you now. Dragged in the surf from the stern and still ticking. Do you want me to crack an egg on your head? We can't leave. Move him to recovery. It says in my manual. Here we wear clothing inside out and backwards. We crawl on hands and knees on non-skid coated decks. We are swatted with short lengths of fire hose, locked in stocks and pelted with... Locked in a water coffin. We crawl through chutes of rotting garbage. A kiss. kiss coated with axle grease. We chop our hair. And this granulating flesh. Scalpel or serrated edge. Our moist pink skin. A protective new layer. Forceps. A cautery. Used to sear wounds shut. Maybe next time. I wouldn't bother packing up. Straight cuts. You have crossed the equator at the prime meridian. I feel ill. The ink's dry. When he wakes. I want. If he wakes. My dear sweetheart. I have to go. All their letters home start with that. I can't do this. Empty his pockets. Find the trinkets, little lockets, a tiny skein of baby hair, tied with a bow. I wondered what they'd find if they searched me. What? I wrote a dinner plan on this post-it note. Stuffed peppers. S here. I was just going to heat something up. Stuffed peppers in a bag. Green peppers or red? Red. Green peppers are red peppers that haven't ripened yet. Big plans. The fluid in my brain is pushing against my skull. It's pushing down and... Huh. Did you hear me? All I have to do is... Is bake our dinner at 375. I heard you. I just want... That'll be nice. I just want to feel normal.
It builds morale. The oceans are getting... Shut up. I'm doing a quiz. When we see that the administration and the staff care... That's genuine. The forests are... I can't full. think. Race. Sex. I'm a Libra. That stuff is bullshit. Fertile soil. Bioavailability is no longer available. Please try again later. Elephants, wildebeest, hippopotamus! Imagine escaping extinction events only to... Height. Five feet something. How many inches do you think I am? This many. Weight. Perfect. You might have been when you got here. I heard one of them say food's their best tool for security management. Does it smell good in here to you? I think it smells great. They saw a decrease of flying insects, but Comments, I didn't like None. This quiz sucks. Today, let's have pretend turkey and dressing. It's called Mash stuffing. It's called dressing. It, it was called dressing. Who calls it dressing? Dressing is for salad. No one eats salad. I like some roughage with my meat. And corn. Creamed corn. <gasps> Canned creamed corn. Canned creamed corn from a can. Best thing ever. It's disgusting. Today there's a choice. It's peach cobbler or vanilla cake with chocolate icing for dessert. Nope. What do you mean, nope? The two of us agreed. The only choices today are pumpkin pie or pecan pie. Dumbass. Eat your pretend pecan pie. I don't give a shit. I have a headache anyway. Me too. My head's killing me. You said this is supposed to be comfortable. It's totally fine. We're fine. Maybe you read the directions wrong. We're good. We just need these feelings of thirst to subside. <gasps> Let's think about chocolate ice cream. How long will this take? For most, ten days. Ten days? That means I've got eight more days altogether? Hard to say. I've got seven. What happens then? I've heard it can take weeks. What can? This. The waiting. But this is the hard part. They said it's still moving much faster than we are. It was. Warm air in the high Arctic. Frozen temperatures below. They say that 90% of teenagers have chemicals from plastic in their bodies. Had. Let's have pretend coffee. At the end of our big meal, we'll have a nice coffee. That's always a treat. The cups feel good in your hand. And the sound of the spoon? It's like a blue macaw. A northern white rhino. It sounds like the sky. <laughs> it's good closure. <clears throat> Let us pray. Our harvest being gotten in... At first, you will feel the same as you did before starting. Hunger pangs and thirst may occur the first day. This brochure recommends mouth swabs or lip balm. Well, that's like chapstick. Do you have any chapstick? No, I don't have chapstick and I wouldn't share it if I did anyway. It says to try cool water rinses. Here, use your shirt. Oh, wet your mouth a little. That's better. Thanks. I feel so peaceful. Like I can finally stop fighting? It's a pleasant lightheadedness. Recreation. Exercise. For three days, we entertained and feasted. And bestowed upon, upon the captain. So plentiful a time it was at this time with us. By the goodness of God. We are so far from want. So far. <laughs> <laughs> There's supposed to be an analgesic effect caused by dehydration. Are you getting it yet? I can't do this. I'm thirsty too. But I'm thirsty. I may mention here a special work of Providence. Sorry. Sorry. Hallucinations are normal. I'm a little on edge. Understandable. After a few days, energy levels will decrease and we'll be sleepier. Give me that back. The water's mine. We were supposed to do this together. I don't want to do it anymore. Your curses fall on your own head. Come on. We've encountered crosswinds, fierce storms, thoroughly shaken. Downed and cracked. Splinted. Which puts us in some fear that we cannot perform the voyage. In and out of consciousness to return rather than cast ourselves into peril. Maybe just a sip. They'll refill it. We commit ourselves to the will of God and resolve to proceed. That was all of it. Every drop. 
The year that draws to its close has been filled with fruitful fields and healthful skies. If we take care of the little things... The big things never happen. People get a full belly. People get a full belly. They lie in their bunks. They take a nap. They call home. 